3 Ways How to Download Fortnite on iPhone and iPad After App Store Ban How to Redownload Fortnite from the App Store If you ever downloaded Fortnite when it was in the App Store, you can redownload it even if it's no longer available there. Open the App Store, tap on your profile picture, go to Purchased, then tap on My Purchases. If you've purchased many apps, search for Fortnite in the search field. When Fortnite appears in the results, tap on the download icon to re-download it on your device. How to download Fortnite via family sharing? If you personally never downloaded Fortnite to your device when it was available, you can connect to your friends or family members app store purchases that had it downloaded using family sharing. Open the settings app, then tap on your Apple ID name. If no payment method is added, go to payment and shipping. Tap on add payment method. Select the payments method and enter the necessary information. Now, go back to your Apple ID settings and tap on family sharing. If family sharing is not set up, follow the on-screen instructions to set it up. You'll have to add the person that had Fortnite downloaded before. Now, tap on purchase sharing and turn it on. When you're done setting up family sharing, go to your app store. Tap on your profile picture and go to purchased under family purchases. Tap on the shared person's device name. Now, search for Fortnite and tap to download. How to download Fortnite if other methods are not available. This method is not as simple as the first two, but if you or your friends and family have never downloaded Fortnite from the App Store, it's the only option for you. It will take some time, and you'll have to download two additional apps, which you can later delete. But in the end, you'll be able to play Fortnite on your device. Open the Settings app, Scroll down and go to the battery settings. Make sure the low power mode is disabled. Then go back to settings and tap on general. Tap on background app refresh. Tap on background app refresh again and check the Wi-Fi and cellular data or just the Wi-Fi option. Now open the Safari browser and go to toptweaks.live or another similar website. In the search bar, enter Fortnite. When you see Fortnite in the results, tap on the signed button. Then tap on start injection. Wait for Fortnite to inject, and tap on Verify now. Then, you'll need to download two apps and execute the steps required to be able to download Fortnite. When you executed all steps, you can start downloading Fortnite. When the download is complete, you'll be able to start playing Fortnite on your iOS device. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. Combo Cleaner also offers a disk cleaner that will help you clean out the junk accumulated on your Mac. A big files finder that will help you find files that take up the most space on your Mac. A duplicate file finder, which will easily find all duplicate files on local and external hard drives. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more and an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.